Hello everyone, this is Pastor Brett Strohecker with New Beginnings Church in Middletown, Pennsylvania. I don't know what's going on with my hair today. I look like that dude from Ancient Aliens, kind of, don't you think? I don't know, it's just really funky. I don't know, I am I should say I'm a very tired Pastor Brett Strohecker today. Very, very busy lately. But I want to get back to our discussion about the shepherd as our guide the lord being our shepherd we're talking about psalm 23 uh guided by our shepherd here and uh the first verse of this psalm we talked about last time the lord is my shepherd i have everything i need so if you are following the lord jesus in your life you have everything you need to be successful in this world uh, because jesus is going to guide you as shepherd why because he cares about you and he wants to look out for your well-being. He wants to protect you from the predators of this world or the evil things that are going around in this world. And he wants to make sure that all of your needs are met. So let's move on to verse 2. He says, he lets me rest in green meadows. He leads me beside peaceful streams. And what they're talking about here is this. Whenever we find ourselves in a problem situation, it's very unsettling, isn't it? We get really wound up or we get very stressed out uh, or we get agitated or frustrated or even angry um, or very irritable. Uh, and sometimes our anxiety and worry can kick in and take over. So how do we get away from that? Well, we look to the shepherd guided by our shepherd, will he'll lead us to a solution for the situation that we find ourselves in, the circumstances that we find ourselves in. He's going to lead us to the peaceful streams. He's going to guide us into green meadows. Now, think about this. From a shepherd's standpoint, why would a green meadow be important for the sheep? Because that's where they would be able to safely graze and they would get the nourishment that they need uh, to continue to grow and to thrive. And in saying this, the illustration here is, is that the shepherd's going to lead us to resources that will help us solve the problem that we find ourselves in. He's going to lead us to the resources that we need to overcome the situation. And... At the same time, he's going to teach us. He's going to nourish us with his word, the Holy Bible. He nourishes us and gives us more wisdom because the word of God equips us with the wisdom that we need to handle life as it really is. And that's why it's important that we allow the shepherd to lead us to those green meadows so that we can find rest there. We can find the resources that we need. And when you see a solution to your problem or you find the answers to the situation that you find yourself in that will help you get through the circumstances, you find rest. It is very reassuring. It has a calming effect on you or it gives you encouragement that you can get through the situation that you find yourself in. And once you are able to resolve that situation, knowing that the shepherd helped you through it, it's where you are going to find that peaceful water that you sit by. Have you ever sat next to a stream of running water out in the wilderness and just kind of let go for a moment? Those are the moments that you're going to have with the Lord if you allow him to help you resolve your problem. It's going to be just as relaxing, just as soothing as sitting next to that stream that is just trickling by. And that water and that sound is so soothing and so relaxing. And then you got that fresh air coming in and you're going to feel at peace. That's the type of feeling that we get when we have help from Jesus for our problems. So, but we only will achieve that if we allow him to guide us as shepherd of our life. So remember, the Lord is my shepherd. I have everything I need. He lets me rest in green meadows. He leads me beside 
peaceful streams. We'll talk more about this psalm uh, in the next segment. Until then, remember, nothing in this world is more important than the love of Jesus Christ. I'll talk to you soon.